What's up guys and welcome back to another video right into my YouTube channel. Today I'm gonna basically tell you how to fix every kind of frame drop stuttering of FPS drop issue you're currently having with World of Tanks. So stick to the end guys, this will be a step-by-step -step tutorial and in the end you'll probably know what to do in order to fix this kind of issue. Before we start right into the video, I just want to you guys know, let you guys know that, that I would really really appreciate it if you would just leave a like, a comment or a subscription right into my YouTube channel. It would really make my day and help me out as a little YouTuber as I am. Especially subscribing would be such a big support for me guys. You would support my work in YouTube a little bit and I'm gonna really really be thankful for that and I'm gonna thank you for that. So anyways, I would just say let's get right started. So the first step in order to fix this kind of issue is gonna be to open up your task manager by just simply navigating down to your taskbar or using your shortcuts you're gonna navigate down. You're gonna right click and open up your task manager. What I want you to do next is gonna be to navigate to the top left corner of your screens ensuring you're sticking around processes. And the next step is gonna to be to click onto CPU and end every single task which is currently having too much CPU usage and by just and has obviously nothing to do with Windows by just clicking onto end task and do the same thing for a GPU. Yeah guys, um, I'm gonna explain it to you because sometimes on low end or bad PCs it could happen that too many programs, application apps or games running at the same time with too much GPU, CPU usage will cause FPS drops and frame drops and stuttering. So trust me guys and end every single um, yeah, program which which is having too much usage. Trust me, it will help you. Once you're finished, I want you to enter task manager again. And the next step is gonna to be to navigate to your bottom left corner, opening up your settings, navigating right into gaming and sticking around the Xbox game bar, where I obviously want you to turn this off because the Xbox game bar doesn't really come with any benefit besides impacting your performance really bad and uh, also causing FPS drop and stuttering. So obviously turn this off. Next step is going to be to click onto captures and stick around background recording where I want you to go to recording background while I'm playing a game and obviously turn this off. Because especially if this is turned on without you knowing that, this will basically uh, impact your performance really bad. Everyone knows if you're recording something, this will impact your performance, especially on bad PCs. And either way, guys, if you want to record something, you're probably not going to use Windows for that. So either way, just turn this off and come back once in a while if this is really turned off. So check it. Uh, next step is going to wait. Uh, it's going to be to click on uh, to click onto game mode. And what I want you to know that I can't really tell you now to turn this off or on. You need to check it for your system specifically. So just turn this off or on, and stick with this uh, with the setting which is working better. So next step is going to be to turn back or come come back to your main menu and navigate to update and security. We want you to stick around Windows Update. And I know guys, it's going to sound a little bit basic, but trust me, updating every single driver you could possibly update will help you a lot with every kind of issue you're currently having on your PC and also with FPS drops and stutterings. So download the latest version of Windows and just provide the best possible performance for your PC. Once you're finished, I want you to end this task and do the same thing for a graphics card. So if you have AMD, you have Nvidia, it doesn't really matter. Just go to the application and browser and download the latest version of that just to provide the best possible performance in general for your PC. That's it for the video. I hope that I could actually help you out with this one. If it was like that, just leave a like, a comment or a subscription. I'm gonna really be thankful for that. And I'm really sorry if I couldn't help you, but I'm just gonna do my best in order to help you out. Either way, I hope you guys have a wonderful day. See you at the next one and bye.